Welcome to Insider Medicine In-Depth, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma. Neither insurance status nor income level can fully explain why minority children in the U.S. are more likely to suffer perforation of their appendix than white children, according to research published in the Archives of Surgery. Here is some information about appendicitis. It is a condition in which the appendix and appendage of the colon becomes infected and inflamed. Treatment typically involves surgically removing the appendix. If surgery is not performed in time, the appendix may perforate or rupture, which can lead to a life threatening infection. Researchers from the University of Texas Southwestern Medical Center used hospital discharge information dating from 2001 to 2008 to calculate the difference in appendicitis perforation rates between whites and minorities and to try to determine the causes of these differences. While there were no differences in perforation rates among adults with appendicitis, differences were seen among children with black and Latino children having higher rates of perforation than white children. Health insurance status only explained about 12 to 13 percent of the differences in perforation rates between black and white or Latino children, and income levels explained only 6 to 7 percent of the difference. Among Latino children, some of the difference in perforation rates was explained by the younger age at which Latinos tended to experience perforation, but fully one-third of the difference in the perforation rate compared with white children could not be explained by any of these variables. Similarly, fully two-thirds of the difference in perforation rates seen between black and white children could not be explained by any of the variables. We spoke with Dr. Edward Livingston, corresponding author of the study, who offered some further insight. did this study using a very interesting technique that, that um, economists use. Where they are able to parse out exactly how much any individual factor contributes to an observed phenomenon. And I, I um, collaborated with an economist at UC Santa Cruz using his techniques to try to understand how much, if you see a higher uh, perforation rate in a minority group, how much of that is attributable to the fact that they're a minority or that they're poor. When we did that kind of analysis, what we found was very little of the perforation rate could be explained by either their race or socioeconomic status or insurance status, and that most of the contribution to the higher perforation rate in, in minorities were factors other than access to health care. Today's research demonstrates that appendicitis perforation rates are not a good tool for estimating children's access to health care, as it appears that other variables play a larger role in determining which children will experience this potentially life-threatening complication. For Insider Medicine In-Depth, I'm Dr. Susan Sharma.